So you know the saying, the eyes are the window to the soul. I think our stories are the window to our character. And the more you're willing to share stories about your past with other people, the more they get to see into who you really are. Because it's not an accident, the things we remember. When it comes time to tell a story, we don't look back at what we had for breakfast four years ago and describe how runny the eggs were. We talk about pivotal experiences in our lives that are indelible in our memories because they touched us at the level of the human spirit. They had an impact on who we became or a decision we made about ourselves, or they had a uh, deep um, lasting effect emotionally on how we have unfolded in our lives and who we dare to be today. So I want to highly encourage anyone out there who just wants to succeed or progress professionally or wants to be more happy personally, who wants to have more friends, better relationships in their life, better relationship with their spouse, more professional opportunities. If any of that is what you want, I encourage you to share your story. Share, share the stories of your life with other people. Find places to do that. And my experience has been the more I share my stories, the more I learn about myself, who I am, what I have to offer, places that I might be stuck or playing it safe. And the universe gets more and more generous with me, the more generous I am in sharing my stories. And if you want some help and support with how to go about sharing your stories, maybe that's a new idea to you, um, then you can go to uh, pivottothepodium.com, which is soon to be honestlyhuman.com. I'm in the midst of a transition between the, the between the name right now. But right now it's at pivottothepodium.com. If you don't find it there, go to honestlyhuman.com. And I've got all, all sorts of resources and uh, support material to learn how to tell better stories and to do it more confidently. Thanks for watching today, and I'll see you again soon.